Hello and welcome to yet another gift giving session. Let's go straight into it. Here we go. Question. What do you think your parents would prefer more? Is it option number one? Yum, 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 yum. And if you don't like banana, then you put something else inside there. Is it option number one or is it option number two? Right, so the question is, which one do you think their money would prefer? Is it option number one, a professionally beautifully done um, crepe? Or is it option number two, mess, which they made? What would you say? Option number one, option number two? I'm not asking what you would prefer. The question is, what do you think that their mother would prefer? Or your parents would prefer option number one or option number two? Okay, what would you say? Well, let's look at the response you know with the option number it's two. Bad. Yes, sir. Oh my goodness. This is beautiful. We made it! It's a double layered crepe. So the mother seems to really enjoy that. Do you think it's the taste that she enjoys or do you think it's more the effort that the kids put in? I think you've got it. It's clearly, it's the effort they put in. But what tastes nicer? What do you think the mother prefers? Do you think the mother prefers the effort or the taste? And I think the answer is actually, is that when it comes to a parent, <coughs> when it comes to a parent, the preference is actually, is the effort more than the taste. Let's give another analogy for this. Imagine the scene that you go to a theatre and you watch a play. Do you care if it's one actor over the other actor? Do you mind if they said, you know, the night before that someone actually had a cough <coughs> <coughs> and therefore they were taken off and someone was put on? Do, do you care about that? Not really, because when it comes to a theatre, I don't care about the actors. What I care about is the quality of the play and I want to make sure the play is the best play possible. So I don't really care who the actors are. However, a play is different from a child's performance. When your parents, when you put on a school play, it could be the best play in the entire world. It was unbelievable, it was amazing. But if someone's kid wasn't there and say, like, oh, I'm sorry, we have to take your kids out in order to make the performance go well, do you think the parents are happy? No, 
Because when it comes to parents who are coming to a child's performance, I don't actually care how the play is. I don't really care about that. I want to know my child's in the play. And I want to know what they did. I'm not looking for the play. So when it comes to the theatre, I care about the play. But when it comes to coming to a child's performance, when it comes to a theatre, when, when you are putting a production on at school, your parents want to see you. They want to see you and your efforts. That's what they care about more than how great the play is. They want to see how much you took part. There are two, um, there are two tablets. There is number one and number two. The difference between them is the first tablet is between man and God. When I say man, I mean man and women, people and God. And the second tablet is between people and people. I want to look at just the ones between man and God for now. There we go. With the laws of between man and God, <coughs> there is a concept called a hood or mitzvah, making the mitzvah look beautiful. And therefore, as opposed to just, you know, say, for example, having a sukkah, it's really important to make sure the sukkah looks absolutely beautiful. Why? Because, you know, Hashem is our parent and Hashem wants to see the effort. It's the effort that he cares about. And when you're putting, making the sukkah look beautiful with all your efforts, that's what Hashem wants to see. Hashem, you know what? Hashem doesn't need the theatre. If Hashem wants to see mitzvot done beautifully, perfectly, he can speak to the angels. The angels, they don't have any Yetzirah, they don't have any desire to do bad. They are perfect. But Hashem's not interested in the angels. He's interested in seeing us. He wants to see how well we perform, how much effort we put in. And therefore, when we put effort in, when we make things look beautiful, that, Hashem says, that is what I want. <clears throat> so it comes to davening as well. Do you think Hashem needs us to be able to, you know, Hashem doesn't need us to daven, but he wants to see how much effort we put in. That's what it is. It's not about, it's not, you know, Hashem will say, well, I looked over here, you said every single word correctly. You didn't mean a single word, but you said every word correctly, tick. No, he wants to see that hearts there, not, oh, are you going to finish that? But he wants to see that we're passionate about it and that we really want to be able to connect. And with our efforts, that is what is important to him. Okay, now, we've got the laws between man and God. We've got the laws between man and man, people. I want to look at laws between man and people. Okay? When it comes to people, <coughs> in the same way that when it comes between Hashem and us, we're saying it's the effort that counts. So too, so often, so often when we're talking about giving, when we're talking about kindness, it matters how much effort you put in. And I will give an example for that, okay? Let's say, for example, it comes to someone's birthday. Option number one, you go into the shop and you have a look around. It's like birthday section, you know, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. There we go. You just pick any cards off the shelf. Is it worth something? Of course it is. You went out of your way to go to the shop and just pick a card. But you know what's better than just picking any random card? Is when you get to the shop, you're actually going to look and you're going to look at every single message <coughs> and every single picture and you choose specifically say that card, that's the one I want. This one over here is perfect, really, really fits perfectly. OK, you know what's even better than that? What's even better than that actually is if you choose and you say, no, I'm actually going to write the card myself. Now, if you make the card yourself, is it going to be as professional? No. Is it going to be written as beautifully? No, but is it preferred more? Yes, it is. Why? Because you put so much more effort in. Because so much <coughs> about giving is not about how much you give, but rather the effort you put in. That can be seen through that. that the effort you put in can be seen. Okay? To not only just write a message, but to be able to colour in, to be able to draw a message. <gasps> that is even way, way better than way way better so what we're saying from here in this very short presentation is it's about the efforts not the results okay but the efforts that get seen and that's how much shows kindness now on our gift website right now we have a whole load of cards that you can download <coughs> we would like you to be able to take one of those cards okay download it print it off color it in send it back to us OK, and we will find, OK, either with one of the cards, a carer, someone, a nurse or a doctor to be able to give it to them, saying thank you so much for being able to look after us at this time. Or we'll be able to give it actually to someone in a care home who might be kind of bored at the moment. And when they see this card, OK, they're going to look at this card and say, well, who coloured this in? A child coloured this in? For me? Really? Oh, 
that is so nice, that is so beautiful. A child took their time to be able to carry the card for me and write a message. That is awesome. That is just, oh, oh, I want to cry. That's so nice. They would be crying because they're sad and they're crying because they're so excited about it. What an incredible thing to do. So you go to our website and on our website, take one of the cards, download it, print it off, colour it in and be able to write a message. And then if you scan it in or take a photo, email us back all the details are on the website, okay, then we will send it out to someone. And if you want as well, you can take one of the cards and be able to colour it in. And also, there's one for Pesach, um, or have a look at the other cards, and you can give, if you want, you can give them out yourself. And I'm telling you this now, I guarantee you, the more effort you put in, the more people go, oh, oh, that's so beautiful. Because what we're looking for in giving is not how professional it is, not how amazing it is. We're looking at how much effort, because your effort never ever goes to waste okay be great be a giver and we'll see you on the next video